Hi guys, so I decided to do a quick update of my eyebrows and I share a little bit about whether I regret and any tips that I may have since getting them about three years ago now. If you haven't watched the video of when I got my brows done, I'll post it up here somewhere. I think I did the post care as well in that video. However, since then, I haven't gone back for the filler or the refill as they call it. The world became what it was, like that situation that was happening in the world for the last couple of years happened. And so, yeah, I decided not to go back. And then also, I got pregnant and had my baby. So I didn't want to add another dimension of pain into my life. Um, because that experience was actually quite painful and the idea of doing that while I was pregnant was not something that I wanted to do. Yeah, so fast forward to three years pretty much later. I do not regret getting them done at all. Like I think it's the best thing that I did for myself because um, if you can see, I deliberately didn't wax or didn't tweeze my brows so that you can see where my eyebrows naturally fall. So my natural eyebrows fall down here and so up here is where the the kind of um, tattoo is so it goes up same thing with this side I mean I haven't brushed them or anything so it doesn't look that cute but um, yeah up here is where they tattooed and then my brow naturally falls down here so it does make a difference in terms of framing your face like I think it just gives like a kind of a eye lift if that makes sense I would love to get them refilled and maybe slightly reshaped I don't think I would want to go any thicker than this because I feel like when you have them this size it allows you to fill them in if you want to fill them in to make them thicker but I've never been a thicker brow person I also don't wear that much makeup and so or I rarely wear makeup and so I think that maybe if I was a fancy makeup person, I would want them thicker, but I'm not daring enough to get that look yet. I think that, but I do want to get them, I don't know, updated somehow at some point soon. Um, if I find someone locally to do it, that would be fantastic. But yeah, the tips I have are still the same. Um, shop for an artist who you have seen other photos Go in knowing the exact design that you want on your face. I've seen some horror stories. And also, just be ready for pain. Some people say it wasn't that bad, but for me, it was really, really painful. Yeah, so just make sure you do your homework and you, yeah, you kind of know what you're, you're getting beforehand. I want to get them done soon, so hopefully when I get them done, I will, or if I get them redone, I will do another video to show you guys what it looks like. I'm just going to end this video now and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!